Greetings, Munder Difflins, and thank you to all the affiliate branches that submitted their submissions to our Muffies, I mean, Mondays Award. Because of the social distancing nature of this event tonight, we have compiled all your video submissions into one video. We will show each branch's submission, followed by their respective award. And warning, this video is so hot, it should only be viewed in the private tab of your browser. And a big happy 1-4 to Miss Kate Wisniewski. Done? All right. Hello, employees of Munder Difflin, America's favorite mask company. Welcome to the first annual weekly coronavirus update from me, your company president. Exciting week at Munder Difflin. It's our first annual company anniversary this Saturday, May 9th. And the party planning committee, PPC for short, would like you to know that it's Kate Wisniewski's 14th birthday. We will also be giving out our special awards, the Muffies, I mean, the Mundies, at this party. So please get your recommendations and nominations in for the Mundies soon. In the lead up to the Mondays, we are working with a social distancing film crew who will be interviewing our employees for the rest of this week. In addition, I want to introduce our latest mask design. I am the Phantom of Corona. <laughs> I know you'll figure it out. It's just a mask after all. But seriously, folks, after the very unfortunate incident with Mr. Van Gogh and our shipping department, we are also introducing a new mask holder designed by our very own Holly Scheib to take the strain off your ears. Mr. Vincent, you have one more chance to get it right. Well, that's it for this weekly update, employees. Remember, mask not what your company can do for you, but what you can do to your company. My name is Zank Scalawag and I'm the assistant to the assistant regional manager. I've been hearing these rumors about a birthday, which is a load of bull. You only have one birthday, and that's the day you're born. Everything else is just an anniversary of your birthday. In honesty, we should be celebrating anniversaries, because they're yearly, not a birthday. Hello and hi. I am Holly. I am the assistant helper to the interim temporary administrative director of the departmental office for removing and eliminating extraneous duplicative redundancies. How do I feel about the Mondays? Well, in the interest of eliminating redundancies, I am very concerned with our president's interest in the trace leches cake. Certainly, uno leche is enough. Dos leches is duplicative. Tres leches is extraneous. Basta, I say. Paul Wisniewski with Munder Difflin again. As we get down to the home stretch before our prestigious awards ceremony this Saturday, the Muffies, I mean Mondays, all of my employees are getting distracted by these bogus, made-up commercial holidays. I mean, today is Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de Mayo. What's so exciting about mayonnaise? What's next? A fourth of mustard? Eyes on the prize, employees. Eyes on the prize. This Saturday, May 9th, the Muffies. Mondays. Be there. Hello, I am Kate Wisniewski, and I am the mask engineer here at Wonder Difflin. I was very surprised to see that my birthday would be on the same day as the Monday Awards, and a little nervous too, but I really hoped that you guys would reach out, and I hope to hear from all the other branches, since we can't be together on my birthday and the Monday Awards. Everyone's going, I'm new, and everyone's going crazy on this Dundee Awards. Is it working? Oh, it's working! Hi, I'm Sage. I'm the receptionist at Monday Diplin, and I just wanted to say I am so excited for the Mondays. I really hope everyone gets nominated for what they want. Everyone just has fun, right? That's all that matters. And I also heard we have a birthday surprise! <laughs> and I just wanted to say happy birthday, Kate. I really hope you have a good birthday. 
Um, I think the reason that I love birthdays so much is because when I was a kid, I never had any. My foster parents would not let me have any birthdays. They would say, if you have a birthday, you are out of the house and you are back to foster care. <laughs> well, bye. I hope you have a good birthday, Kate. And yay, Mondays. Hi, Kate. Happy birthday. My name is Rayleigh. I'm a customer service representative from Munder Difflin at the Richmond branch, and I'm so excited to hear about your 14th birthday. Uh, you know, I wanted to send a gift, but my girlfriend, uh, Rihanna, he told me that she told me that, you know, I could send you a gift now or I could give her the money and she would invest it and then get you a gift like 50 times as great as the one I was going to get you. So, of course, I have to go with that. And so be sure to be on the lookout for that later and also i'm sorry i can go to the party i mean billy eilish is trending on twitter with charlie Diamilo after billy said that she was better at the renegade dance and you know i can't miss miss charlie's comeback but i'm so excited for you i followed you and your brother's adventures for like i guess like the last 10 years you know went to high school with with your mom so that's all exciting and everything so i expect nothing but great things from you so happy birthday from the richmond branch of munder difflin Well, I appreciate your management style. I have come to find out that Monday Difflin is corrupt and withholding masks from essential workers and the most vulnerable community members. So, my friend, well, I am just a low-level warehouse worker. I will lead the revolution. I have stolen all your mass supply and will hold them until one million dollars worth of masks are donated to essential workers. Ha, you have 24 hours or else. Have a good birthday. Hi, Kate. I'm Chrissy from the New Orleans branch. Um, I am the assistant to the executive assistant to the regional director of elastic inspections here in New Orleans. And I was really hoping to be there for the Munder Difflin Awards, for the Mondays, um, and for your birthday. Um, but, and not many people know this, and I'm kind of excited, but I'm a little, I don't know. Anyway, um, so I don't know if you know David. So David's in fabric sales here in the New Orleans branch. And actually he and I have been talking for some time about opening a bunny sanctuary. I know it sounds a little crazy. Um, and I don't actually know if he's serious about it, but if we do do that, then we're gonna be leaving the, comp the company. So again, I haven't really heard anything from him. And I don't really know whether or not he's gonna. Hey, are you ready? You ready to go? Happy birthday, Kate. Happy birthday. My name is Evangeline Campion. I'm the social coordinator for Munder Difflin. And with the recent change of events, I've become the social distancing coordinator. So I decided to throw a birthday party for Kate, with some modifications. Things didn't go so well. <laughs> what? Achiever. So instead of being six feet away from you, I'm 1,644 miles away from you. Happy birthday, Kate. I miss you. Hi, I'm Cullen. I tie the strings up under different. 
What do I think about the Mondays? I think the stores are already low on supplies and there is no time for this. Good luck to all the candidates. I'll just be here working. Happy birthday. my baby as the best baby there is. Here's a haiku I wrote to express how great my baby is. My baby, the best. He's number one, baby. 10 out of 10, yo. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh. Cut. I said stop. Who would you like? Hi everybody, Violet Elder here, Assistant Budget Analyst to the Chief Budget Analyst to the Chief Financial Officer of Munder Difflin. Um, I have been charged with buying awards for the Muffies on Saturday, but they've only given me a budget of about $30. And so all I'm gonna be able to provide are like Starbucks coupons, so um, President Wisniewski, if that's okay with you, I'll get those in the mail to you really quickly. And everybody have a great time. And um, Kate, have an awesome birthday. Bye-bye. Hey folks, this is Michelle Lopez from the Miami branch of Munder Difflin. I'm the Associate Director of Financing for Masquerade, a subsidiary of Munder Difflin. Uh, we make snorkel masks, um, given our area. And, um, you know, things are a little crazy down here. Unfortunately, I won't be able to make it to the Mondays. Um, my passport was confiscated outside of Disney World in Orlando. Um, and as you're well aware, you can't fly in or out of Florida without a passport. So apologies to everyone, um, especially there's a birthday at the Mondays, Kate Wineski. Uh, happy birthday, Kate. If you're like, who is this old lady? I was your first babysitter a long time ago, um, Miss Michelle, as you sweetly called me. And I want to wish you a very happy birthday. I think it's amazing that you are super into The Office. It's one of my favorite shows. And I wanted to share with you something that I got my husband, who's also a big fan. Um, I think you'll appreciate this. It's a threat level midnight movie poster. Anyways, you guys are great. Happy birthday. Bye-bye. Greetings, Munder Difflin. Um, sorry I missed the awards this year and, and Kate's party as well. Um, I've been stuck up here in Canada. Um, everyone up here is uh, wearing masks and gloves. Um, some even when they're not playing hockey. Uh, it's truly crazy. Um, everyone is keeping six feet apart, which is good. Um, but when you convert it to metric, it ends up being like two kilometers. So I haven't seen many other people up here. Um, but since I'm the chief innovation officer for the company, um, I've decided to, you know, take this opportunity and, uh, maybe explore some less conventional suggestions about how we can treat this virus. Um, I found some very strong uh, UV light uh, and I'm going to see if I can get it into the body, um, through the skin, or maybe some other way. So uh, I'll let you know how that turns out. So how do I feel about Kate winning the Monday Award um, for Best New Mask Design instead of me? I'm, I'm thrilled for Kate. I um, am just so happy for her that <laughs> I just mm, mm. Because, um, you know, I give this company 60 hours a week. 
Uh, and my uh, contributions are never really recognized, but I am thrilled for Kate. And I also, mm, here, ugh, that it's um, her birthday tomorrow for the Monday. So that's just an extra special uh, double thing for Kate. <sighs> Kate, Kate, with her long, blonde, perfect hair and her... <clears throat> perfect skin and her just perfect perfectness <laughs> you know um i'm sure the uh, <clears throat> powers that be thought that my new mask design was going to be second place i went for a minimalist look um i chose orange because the idea is that the um the face should mimic a sunshine the hairs at the top mimic the rays, and the powers that be chose not to honor me with the Monday for best new mask design, but <laughs> that's fine. It's really not a problem because, you know, I have my health, and I have my <clears throat> liver, what's left of it, and I have my um, work friends and family, and I have my... Um, my <clears throat> cats. I have my cats. So this is me just saying congratulations, Kate. I can't think of anyone more deserving than you. <gasps> well, <clears throat> except maybe me. Maybe I would have been more deserving. Yeah, I think I would have been more deserving. But um, anyway, <laughs> Oh, oh, we all have fun at the Mondays tomorrow. I think I won't be there because I'm going to have a hangover. Happy birthday, Kate. Happy birthday, Kate. From the New York office of Munder, Munder Diflin. Diflin. Yay, Yay, have a great day. Have a great birthday. Hey Kate, Scholar Stoltz here from the Northern Virginia branch of Munder Dufflin. Work in the uh, product development branch. I'm not liking this mask too much. I think this is a little bit better. Anyway, I'm really sorry that I can't make it to your birthday. Really wish it could be for the Mondays this year. Hope it's a great one. Man, this mask isn't too good either. This one's working a little bit better. But anyway, happy birthday. I hope it all goes well for you at the awards ceremony. Good evening and happy Casual Friday from the Irvine branch. I'm Brian Pyle Pagel, acting co-chair of the Committee on Undermining Special Help and Nepotism in Employment and Retention. That's committee with a K. And I'm Jeremy Pyle Pagel, also acting co-chair of the committee with a K on Undermining Special Help and Nepotism in Employment and Retention. Hi, I'm Daniel Pyle Pagel, Acting Vice President of Legos for the Committee with a K on Undermining Special Help and Nepotism in Employment and Retention. And this is Rayana Pyle Pagel, Acting Silent Director of Sarcasm for the Committee on Undermining Special Help and Nepotism and Employment and Retention with a K. It has come to our attention that there may be undisclosed family ties between certain MD team members including some featured in the videos you have seen recently. Rest assured, a detailed investigation has been launched and will be completed in a thoroughly fair and balanced manner. I feel it is incumbent upon this committee to remind all employees at Munder Difflin of our tremendous company's strict policy against the employment and retention of other family members, especially younger, unqualified familial relations. I mean, all it takes is one time, and then who knows? It could soon spread like a sickness across the land, driven by gross incompetence and deliberate ignorance, dragging us all down to the depths of despair. Yes, or something. Now that that's out of the way, all of us here at the Committee on Undermining Special Help and Nepotism and Employment and Retention 
Hope you enjoy this year's Mundy Awards. Looks like someone's got a case of the Mundies. And happy birthday to Kate. I'm sure she got her job on her own merits. <clears throat> Whenever I'm about to do something, I think, would an idiot do that? And if they would, I do not do that thing. Why tip someone for a job I'm capable of doing myself? I can deliver food. I can drive a taxi. I can and do cut my own hair. I did, however, tip my urologist because I am unable to pulverize my own kidney stones. When my mother was pregnant with me, they did an ultrasound and found she was having twins. When they did another ultrasound a few weeks later, they discovered that I had resorbed the other fetus. Do I regret this? No. I believe his tissues made me stronger. I now have the strength of a grown man and a little baby. I don't, I don't want to talk about it. Thank you to everybody for your videos. They were so fun and I really enjoyed them. Um, and they were super funny and I really appreciated all of your responses and hearing about all the other branches. I also want to give a special thank you to Bob Vance, Vance Refrigeration, for these amazing flowers. And also to Miss Charlotte, his secretary, because I know you sent them.